Hi, uh, today we'll talk about uh, hotel recommendation system using Python. So here in this project, uh, we'll be taking uh, uh, 500 plus key uh, hotel reviews data from Kaggle. So you can just check uh, the link where we, uh, uh, you know, uh, take, I mean, took the database data set from. So I'll just uh, give a structure of the project. You know, we'll go for a visualization of the project and the visualization of the data set. The first thing and uh, probably we'll, we'll try to cluster it. Okay. And then we'll go for the recommendation uh, basically. So recommendation is basically like, you know, you can uh, want to find out like what are the type of uh, you know, leisure or business type and solo or family room kind of things and number of days stay. So we're going to use these uh, factors and also we're going to uh, find the recommendation based on the uh, user reviews and also like uh, we're going to see like you know uh, the recommendations by the user okay so basically techniques what we uh, normally used in this project is like uh, uh, we worked with regression model and recommendation and correlations and also like classification tree analysis okay so and this is the data analysis uh, data set what we took in for and uh, we're going to run uh, using uh, Jupyter Notebook Python. So, so that will be the uh, process. Okay. Uh, so these are the codes what we have right now. And uh, so let's let's directly go with you know uh, we can just find out uh, the popular hotels based on uh, different features first. Okay. So let's see like uh, you know what are the features available. So let's let's talk about that. So I'm going to run the entire kernel uh, and select restart with the dialog and say restart. Okay, so kernel is ready and it's running and see um, the input what it takes is the hotel reviews and it's going to categorize. Okay, this is just a visualization I'm going to use. Okay, I'm going to categorize it uh, basically on the hotel address, you know, uh, scores, review dates and average score hotel name and also the negative reviews you know and we have like more columns coming up and uh, so okay so uh, the total number of distinct features of the hotel so I'm going to find out what are the distinct so it's like 55,242 so it's huge uh, huge data set what I've taken okay and uh, so I'm going to uh, list out the unique tags actually so this is the main part you know uh, so I'm going to list out the tags and the unique tags okay what are the you know, different kind of tags available in the reviews so these are the uh, unique tags I'm going to uh, filter. So I'm going to plot it. Uh, no, I'm going to plot it based upon the, uh, uh, no, how I'm, uh, the popular hotels and uh, top ten hotels. Okay. So the hotel name versus the uh, leisure score. So. And I'm going to take like for business. I'm going to uh, plot uh, the top 10 for business. So for leisure, I have plotted it here, and for business, we are plotting here. And then uh, we are going for like with couple de uh, destination. Okay. So which are the hotels preferred for couples? So okay. Um, and then. So I'm going to use uh, <clears throat> solo decision. So what are the hotels you know prefer for uh, solo travelers and uh, group travelers? So group destinations. So these are the graphs come up for executing the course. Okay. So now let's go with. Uh, okay. So we'll also go with the uh, other one is um, yeah. So like I'll go with the top ten hotels in Europe based on scores. Okay. I'm just going with the scores. And I'm going to find out what the top 10 uh, hotels, you know. Okay. So I'm restarting the kernel. So this is the input and you can see the outputs here. Okay. So here we go. So we're going to find out the hotel names based on the scores. What are the top scores? Okay. So the, we have like no reviewer scores. Okay. What are the scores? And based on that, I'm going to plot it. So based on that's called as a popularity. So, because that is defined by the scores. Okay. So this is okay. Uh, next, uh, I'm going to see like how uh, the top ten hotels you now perform over time. Restart the kernel and say restart. Okay. Fine. Here it goes. Okay. So this is the graph. Uh, is saying like you know the based on the time duration okay the reviewer score okay
and these are the hotels based upon the hotels names you know you'll see the reviews days and times the huge uh, graph coming up for the all the hotels as such top 10 okay here it goes so, so these three what we saw is like more into visualization of the data okay because we are not nothing we are not working on the recommendations yet so <clears throat> let's uh, let's go with the recommendations so first we'll start with an content based you know uh, hotel recommendation so it's going to recommend uh, based on the content uh, okay here we go so let me restart the kernel it will take some time So once again, it pulls up the data set uh, hotel reviews. Okay, so from that, you know, we're going to check that, you know, negative word counts, total positive word counts, blah, 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 a lot of things are going to take it up. So I'm going to have a count on the business counts, leisure counts, solo travelers, you know, I'm just uh, classifying uh, based upon uh, the tags. Okay, so I'm, um, and then, you know, we're going to move forward. Okay, here it goes. So here it goes, you know, we're going for the average score and also the hotel names and total number of reviews and latitude, longitude and the business, leisure, solo, group, etc, etc. So this is the uh, clustering of the data. Okay, so now I'm going to recommend, so I'm going to get the recommendation for, you know, Milestone Hotel in Kingston, okay. So let's assume that I want to stay, I mean, I want to stay in this hotel, so I, I'm just trying, I'm trying, trying to get a recommendation for this. So these are the hotels which are recommended, you know, uh, along with the, uh, along with my preference. So you can see these things, okay. So this is a Jupyter Notebook, so you can see the output here and this will be your input command. So when I when I want to uh, when I want when I, when I prefer to prefer to stay in a hotel, you know, I am going to use the recommendation system and it's going to recommend me these much hotels, uh, uh, which will be like on on par with uh, my uh, uh, I mean uh, my target kind of thing. So this is how we get the recommendation, this thing. And next, let's go. We are going to go for hotel recommendation based on the reviews. Yep. Okay. So uh, once again, here it goes with uh, the hotel reviews and stuff. Okay. Uh, let me close other things because it's going to access the same data set. So it's running up, so take few minutes. I'm just running all the stuff. So let me get yeah, here we go. Okay, so uh, so it's going to classify into like negative reviews and positive reviews based on the hotel names and the hotel names and negative reviews and positive reviews based on the reviews. Okay, fine. Uh, so once you're done with this, you know, uh, I'll go for uh, the review text. Okay, so what are the review text would be used here? So you're going to extracting the positive and negative and also the hotel name exactly. Running up and uh, display of the data uh, once you know its, it's execution is done. <clears throat> so once again here, what we're trying to do is you know I'm going to recommendation. I'm going to get recommendation for uh, uh, like uh, Cadian Gardens and you know uh, Exo Hotels. So these are the uh, recommendation I'm just trying to get. It. Uh, probably take a couple of minutes to get it uh, to execute it. Yeah. Fine, it's done. So you got this. So, <coughs> so this is basically the recommendation based based upon the reviews, and uh, so you got uh, these much recommendations for the ho for the uh, for Cadigan Gardens. Okay, this is what my uh, expectation, and I got this. 
and the same thing I can see here uh, so both will be different of course and because uh, the, the reviews based upon the uh, what are the based on the reviews changes actually fine so that will be it uh, for this and uh, next let's go with uh, what uh, yeah uh, we are going to uh, go for the hotel recommendation based upon the tax okay So I've run and take a couple of minutes to get that uh, uh, results. Okay, here it goes and uh, you got the business counts and everything. Oh, fine. Perfect, perfect. Okay, uh, so based on the tax. Okay, so this is based, uh, it just categorizes based upon the tax. Okay, uh, that's it for today. Um, and thanks for watching the video. Thank you.